Tuesday of Holy Week, 12th of April 2022. First reading. Reading from the book of Isaiah. Islands, listen to me. Pay attention, remotest peoples. The Lord called me before I was born. From my mother's womb he pronounced my name. He made my mouth a sharp sword and hid me in the shadows of his hand. He made me into a sharpened arrow and concealed me in his quiver. He said to me, You are my servant, Israel, in whom I shall be glorified. While I was thinking, I have told in vain, I have exhausted myself for nothing. And all the while my cause was with the Lord, my reward with my God. I was honoured in the eyes of the Lord, my God was my strength. And now the Lord has spoken, he who formed me in the womb to be his servant, to bring Jacob back to him, to gather Israel to him. It is not enough for you to be my servant, to restore the tribes of Jacob and bring back the survivors of Israel. I will make you the light of the nations, so that my salvations may reach to the ends of the earth. Responsorial Psalm My lips will tell of your help. In you, O Lord, I take refuge. Let me never be put to shame. In your justice rescue me, free me. Pay heed to me and save me. My lips will tell of your help. Be a rock where I can take refuge, a mighty stronghold to save me. For you are my rock, my stronghold. Free me from the hands of the wicked. My lips will tell of your help. It is you, O Lord, who are my hope, my trust, O Lord, since my youth. On you I have leaned from my birth. From my mother's womb you have been my help. My lips will tell of your help. My lips will tell of your justice and day by day of your help. O God, you have taught me from my youth and I proclaim your wonders still. My lips will tell of your help. Gospel Acclamation Glory and praise to you, O Christ. Hail to you, our King. Obedient to the Father, you are led to your crucifixion. As a meek lamb is led to the slaughter, glory and praise to you, O Christ. Gospel Reading from the Book of John While at supper with his disciples, Jesus was troubled in spirit and declared, I tell you most solemnly, one of you will betray me. The disciples looked at one another, wondering which he meant. The disciple Jesus loved was reclining next to Jesus. Simon Peter signed to him and said, Ask who it is he means. So leaning back on Jesus' breast, he said, Who is it, Lord? It is the one, replied Jesus. To whom I give the piece of bread that I shall dip in the dish. He dipped the piece of bread and gave it to Judas, son of Simon Iscariot. At that instant, after Judas had taken the bread, Satan entered him. Jesus then quickly said, What are you going to do? Do quickly. None of the others at the table understood the reason he said this. Since Judas had charge of the common fund, Some of them thought Jesus was telling him, buy what we need for the festival, or telling him to give something to the poor. As soon as Judas had taken the piece of bread, he went out. Night had fallen. When he had gone, Jesus said, Now has the Son of Man been glorified, and in him God has been glorified. If God has been glorified in him, God will in turn glorify him in himself and glorify him very soon. My little children, I shall not be with you much longer. You will look for me. And, as I told the Jews, where I am going, you cannot come. Simon Peter said, Lord, where are you going? Jesus replied, Where I am going, you cannot follow me now. You will follow me later. Peter said to him, Why can't I follow you now? I will lay down my life for you. Lay down your life for me, answered Jesus. 
I tell you most solemnly, before the cock crows, you will have disowned me three times. Gospel of the Lord.